and we are streaming. Let's see if there are people available today. If you're watching the replay, hey. If you're watching live, chat with me, please. <laughs> I always feel so awkward with these things. Um, okay, just gonna wait like a second. You know that I'm just gonna wait for a couple of people to pop on. I hate that, but I am. I'm gonna wait. It's always so awkward. Oh, thank God, someone's there. <laughs> hi, hi guys. <laughs> that little like one minute delay is just always so like nerve wracking. I'm like, please show up, people. Please don't make me talk to myself. It's always so awkward. Okay. <clears throat> hi. Hello, hello. Nice to see everyone. Hi guys, happy Wednesday. I hope you're all having a good day. Um, I did not have a video scheduled for today, so I thought I'd go live and it's actually perfect timing because I wanted to do a behind the scenes look at kind of how I put together the subscription box with Craftimo. Um, and it's perfect timing because they just opened pre-orders for the boxes again. So I am going to give some information about that, clarify a bunch of things just so people don't get confused about, um, lots of stuff because I feel like no matter how many times I say things or things are actually written down, people tend to get confused. And so I want to clear things up. So if you have any questions, um, about the boxes or the process, you can ask me in the chat <clears throat> and I will try my best to answer and we can just chat today and I'll, I'll I'm going to show you some behind the scenes stuff and some sneak peeks of some of the upcoming boxes. Um, if you have already purchased the subscription boxes with Craftimo, this is not, um, the new pre-orders are not for you. You're already subscribed. These are for people who missed pre-orders before, but stay tuned. Cause I'm, I'm going to show you some upcoming stuff. Um, got my June box, watched the video last night. Oh, good. You're a great teacher. What did you do before this? Um, I was a kindergarten early childhood educator. So I taught kindergarten for six years with the Toronto school board. And then I had my son and I decided not to go back. <laughs> and then this just kind of happened. Okay. So I wanted to give you a behind the scenes look for people who don't know what I'm talking about. I'd be like, what, are, what are, subscription boxes are you talking about? This is perfect. I'm going to, I'm going to let you in. Um, I'm going to show you June's box. So I have been working with Craftimo for, I want to say a year and a half now. Um, we originally developed my, I think this is just the box. I don't think there's brushes. Are there brushes in here? We developed my brush set with them, the four piece brush set, which I don't think they're in here. No, these are the ones I'm using. Um, I got to create my dream brushes, design them, everything, the box, and it was amazing. They have done so well. And then last year, last year, I think towards the end of the year, because we did this all pretty quick, they mentioned maybe doing a subscription box collaboration together and they said, you know, you could have your own brand of paint and the paper and new brushes, and then you create a tutorial and we create a box and it goes out monthly. And there's no way I could say no. <laughs> there was like, why would I ever say no to that? That sounds amazing. So we decided to do a collaboration on these boxes. This is June's box. I'm just going to quickly show you. And it kind of developed really fast because we realized it was gearing towards the end of the year. I think we Talk, started talking in September or October and we were like you know what I think we should start to get it out by January January have a full calendar year to have it start so let's let's really get this going so on my part what I had to do was test a bunch of paints they sent me originally they sent me some handmade watercolors and we were going to go with that but then when we realized that it might go on a bigger scale it would be really hard to do the handmade watercolors they went with a factory that um is in china but they also produce windsor newton there too so they're very similar in my opinion um and i got to i think they sent me like over 50 different colors and i had to narrow down my color choices to 48 colors, which if you subscribe for the whole year, you get 
the full 48. I don't think this is even 48. I think I'm missing four because I took them out and then put them somewhere. Look at how well loved this palette is. Um, and I'll explain that in a second. But I had to t narrow it down to 48 colors and then divide them into 12 months of what colors I was going to use. So it was crazy. Um, I feel like when I just said yes and I was didn't realize how much work I was actually going to have to put into this. And it has been like my biggest art, besides my book, because that was a pretty big art project too. This has been one of the biggest and it's still ongoing. I'm still creating the tutorials and the illustrations for the last four boxes. And it's just been this really big project that I didn't think I really realized how crazy it was going to be. So I had to take the 48 colors. I had to choose the 48 colors. Then I had to divide them into 12 months and they had to have a good mixability, a good palette to represent that month. And they just had to make sense. So with the 48 colors, what I did try to do was try and pick out primaries ish so we could get a really great color palette to mix um so you're not just stuck with four colors that didn't mix well together so and they weren't all traditional primaries like maybe i'd have a pink or you know a brown that had a yellow tint to it maybe like a bluish green either way i just wanted them to be able to mix and that was pretty crazy but before i did that i had to come up i had to kind of make a list of each month and ideas of what I wanted to do for that month. So I was, you know, thinking of holidays and um, just inspiration for that time of year, flowers or landscapes and stuff like that. So um, I kind of did a little template of what the painting might be. And it actually changed a few times and it continues to change as I keep going with it. And then I tried to pick the colors that would go along with it. And that was so hard. And then not only that, because in our subscription boxes, you get four little pan colors. I should probably show you. <laughs> Where did I just, oh, my box is right in front of me. Um, so you get in your box, you get, I, there's no paint in here, but you get four little colors. And then I put the little stickers of what colors were inside on the back. And you also get, uh, five pieces of 100% cotton paper, which I will let you know, people are like, what paper is this? Um, I tested over 20 different types of cotton paper. Like these are a bunch of tester papers. I believe this is the one I went with. It was the 100% 100% cotton cold press, 300 GSM um, smooth. And like I, I had to test and test and test to see which one I liked the best. Um, it was crazy. But yeah, so in the box you get those four um, half pans and then you also get two brushes. And if we were going to do 12 different paintings, two brushes in the box, I had to make sure I didn't repeat any brushes. And I also didn't want to repeat any brushes that were in my set. I think the only one I did end up having to repeat was the size 12. And I figure, you know what? I use my size 12 all the time. It's not a bad thing to have to. Um, so I had to come up with two different brush sizes and shapes for every box. And that was like so hard only because I have ever only really used round brushes. And so uh, I had to learn how to paint with other brushes. So we have filbert brushes, we have dagger brushes, which I had never used, um, angle brushes, cat's tongue brushes, and all different sizes. Um, so it was really, really hard <laughs> to kind of pair, like I wanna do this painting, but I my go-to brush would be a, a round brush. What other brush could I learn how to paint this with? So it was insane. Um, but I figured it out and I feel so proud and accomplished because I did figure it out and it, and it's going well. Um, but it was like the biggest challenge and art project that I've ever done in my life. So it was insane and it is insane, but it's so much fun. Um, let me just see any questions. Um, sorry, I'm just making sure I'm not missing anybody. What painting did you do last time? Which, what do you mean what painting did I do? I'm not sure which one you're asking. 
like painting for the boxes because that's what we're talking about. Um, you must have really stretched your skills too, plus all your patrons and channels. So, yeah, it it it's been crazy. It but it has helped me grow as an artist too, which is awesome. Oh my, I knew it must have been a lot of work, but this is insane. You are incredible. Thank you so much. It was I. It was definitely a bigger challenge than I actually thought it was going to be. I don't. I didn't really take into consideration when I said yes of how challenging it was going to be, but I'm so happy that I did it because it worked and I got to learn so much about different brushes and paints and stuff like that. Can I subscribe to the boxes? Okay. So now that I kind of talked about like the process of how we did this and there was like lots of testing and everything going through, um, the boxes are now up for pre-order again at craftmo.com. So, um, in the description of the video, I have put the link. I don't know if it's there right now. It should be, but if you go there, you can subscribe. So make sure I'm going to say this, make sure you read all the fine print because I feel like a lot of people just click and they don't actually read a lot of the fine print with stuff. So I just want to make sure that you know everything that's coming. So if you go to craftimo.com, it should be in the description. Um, you can, I like, I have a whole page on their site and you go to my subscription boxes. So what we are doing right now is we are opening pre-orders. Pre-orders mean that you are ordering in advance for the September box. So we are opening boxes for September. Right now, my people who have subscribed just received their June boxes. They're gonna get July and August. Yours will come, if you subscribe now, will come in September. And I said this last time with the May boxes when we opened it up for May and people are like, why didn't I get April? I'm like, because it was a pre-order for May. And the reason why we do this is because it's not a huge company. You know, we don't have tons and like thousands of boxes in stock. We make to order. So pre-orders are so we can get numbers of how many people are going to subscribe. Because if we over if we over, um, create, I don't know what I'm saying. Um, if we make more than we sell, then we're left with all this inventory, right? So they are doing pre-orders. So if you pre-order now, you're going to get it in September, 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 September. Um, oh my. Um, and yes, so you can subscribe at, uh, what's it called? At craftimo.com. I just want to make sure that it's um, it's, uh, what's it called? Um, oh my God, my brain is just gone. Don't you love mom brain? That's lovely. I can't, I can't think of anything. <laughs> <clears throat> um, but yeah, so, okay. Sorry. I have no idea what I'm saying anymore. Okay. I'm also trying to read comments and stuff. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Okay, yeah, so subscribe at craftimo.com. So the thing is you can just you can subscribe for like monthly so you can order month to month. If you subscribe, you're going to automatically get every month. You don't have to um, pay or no, you don't have to order again monthly. If you subscribe for the monthly option, you're just going to get it monthly and you're just going to pay monthly. There's also an option to subscribe for six months at a time. So you pay up front and then you will get billed for your shipping every month on top of that. So make sure you read the fine print. Um, so, oh my gosh, I can't read this. Is, you know what? This is where I would love my husband to come in and then read things to me because I can't focus. Um, so yeah, the six months option, you pay up front. You pay monthly on top of that for shipping. So just make sure you know that. And um, after the six months is up, you're automatically renewed for the six months unless you cancel. Same thing for the monthly. You will be billed monthly unless you cancel. You can skip boxes too um, if you want. But if you cancel, it might be you won't be able to order again. Can you get boxes you missed? Okay, so if you um, start with the September box, your yearly subscription will go all the way till next August. Um, we're not doing any new boxes. So if you missed the whole first year, you'll get it next year for 2024. So you'll get September starting in September till August. Okay, Karen, does that make sense? Um, so, 
And then the last option is you can pay for the full year up front. Again, you're going to be paying for shipping every month on top of that. Be aware. Um, but you pay for it all up front and then you get the full year. So let me know if you guys have any questions about that. Um, but yes, you can get boxes that you missed. So you're just going to get them. So if you missed the April box, you're going to get it April 2024. It goes in order. I hope I'm making sense. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just had the biggest brain fart ever. That was ridiculous. <laughs> okay, I'm glad that makes sense. Um, I just want to see what else did I, did I want to say? So they're open now. They will be closing. Um, it's June, July 31st, pre-orders close. So after July 31st, we're closing pre-orders. You will not be able to order after that. So if you're on the fence, you want to think about it for a little bit, that's fine. Um, just make sure if you do want to purchase that you are going to do it before July 31st, because that's when it closes. I don't know if we're going to be reopening it. It might be the last of it. Um, and again, if you are already part of the subscription, you do not need to order again. This is not a different box. If you are already subscribed, you're already getting the September box. I did have someone who made that mistake. They're like, oh, there's more boxes. It's like, no, you're already subscribed. So then you just bought two. And I felt bad. <laughs> uh, love your boxes. It's like Christmas every month. Yay. Oh, I'm so glad. Thanks, Jan. Um, Will I be able to paint on my own? Oh, and I forgot to tell you about the tutorial. So yes, so you get in the box, you get the four colors, two brushes, five pieces of um, watercolor paper that's 100% cotton, and then you get the tutorial. So in the box, you get a card like this. So this is June. Um, and then on the back, because I'm not going to show you because you didn't pay for the June box, but there's information on the back. And then there is like a, a link that you type in on your computer and it has the tutorial of how to paint this. So this is the, the painting that you'll do for June. Um, and then you have the step-by-step -step tutorial and with the tutorial, it's usually like an hour, sometimes longer. Um, and I go through how to mix the paint colors, how to use the brushes, what you can use them for. We'll go through little drills and stuff like that and just warm up and then we'll go into the painting. And then if you're doing a painting like this, which is a bit more structured, for my friends who are not as great at drawing, hold on, where are you? You will also get a template, mine has tape on it. You will also get a tracing template and tracing paper. And then I show you how to transfer the image onto your watercolor paper. So if you're not that great at drawing, then you will have um, a template to trace. So not all of them have that. Like last month's was May and it's, um, where is it? Where is it? Hold on. I'm gonna give you guys a little sneak peek. Some things that other people haven't even seen yet. Um, first I'll show you maize. So maize just happened and it's like this tulip flower hand thing. So this, this had a tracing template because it's a hand and it's a little trickier. Um, which one was I thinking of? So other ones, like some of the landscapes will not have a tracing template. So, okay. If you do not want a spoiler, <laughs> Um, if you do not want a spoiler and you have purchased the boxes, look away for a minute. You can listen, but look away. Um, I'm going to show you July and August's box, which no one has seen before. Nobody has seen July and August box. So if you don't want a spoiler, spoiler alert, spoiler alert, I'm going to show you July and August's, which I am in love with. Okay. So look away if you don't want to see. Ready? So this is Ju <laughs> this is July's box which is super fun. And then this is August box. So what a painting like this wouldn't have a template because um, I show you how to do it. My go-to brushes are my brush set, Maria. Um, they are um, they are a size 12 round, size six round, size two round, and then some sort of flat wash brush to do a background. Um, but yeah, so those are July and August, which I'm really, really excited about. Um, I just completed my September illustration, which I'm really 
excited about. Um, which I don't know if you guys want a sneak peek at. This is going to be September's, which I'm really excited about. Um, there's so much fun. There's so much fun coming up. I'm really excited. I'm really proud of these boxes. They have been a lot of fun to create. Um, but yeah. Uh, okay, let me just read some of the questions. I love my boxes that come every month. But I picked up only six months to start and upped for the next six. Now I have two... Oh, subscriptions coming. I emailed Craftimo, but never heard back. Okay, Mary, um, if you can, message me. Email them again. You will not have to pay. Ugh. When did you... So you have two subscriptions coming. You should hear back. If you want to, message me privately on either Instagram um, or maybe my email or something. And then um, I can also email them on your part. I'll just need to, your order number and all that stuff because, yeah, you don't purchase again. It automatically renews after six months. Um, does the tin hold the watercolor pots? Okay, yes. Yeah. So the tin... No matter when your subscription starts, you will get this as your free gift. Oh, I forgot. I forgot. Um, so with every box, you get a small, like, extra little gift. So the first box, you're going to get this. You're going to get the tin. Um, and if it's after... This was the January free gift, so maybe in January you won't get one because everyone is, like, paired to go with a certain one. Like, June's is, like, a little pencil case, which is really cute. So... In one of the boxes, you got pencils and an eraser. So you have a little pencil case for traveling and you just wrap it around. So fun. Um, lots of fun stuff. <clears throat> um, so you do get the tin with a subscription for your first box. I can't get the subscription box video open to watch. Okay, let me, if you can, email me or I'll put my email in the chat only email me if you have um trouble with the boxes and then i can email craftimo for you if if you need me to um yeah so and then i can send you the the video link if you need it will you ever go what's in the box go over yes i just went over what's in the box so you get four colors two brushes, five sheets of watercolor paper, 100% cotton, um, and then like a little free gift, and then the card that has the tutorial that you follow. Uh, Maria, I'll show my go-to brushes after I'm just talking about the boxes at the moment. <clears throat> um, how much is shipping? Shipping depends on where you are. Um, it, it really depends because we ship worldwide. It depends. Yes. Yeah, so someone said $12 for shipping in the U S so that's, that's how much it is for there, but other parts of the U S might be different. Um, we'll craft a post to the U S the UK. Yes. We ship all over the world. I have people in, um, um, like Australia getting boxes. It's just, we ship everywhere. Okay, I'm trying to focus. This is so hard. Um, um, oh, someone said how many templates are available? So there's one template per box. So there's one tutorial um, that you you can follow, but then you can, by the end of your subscription, you'll have all 48 colors. And then by the end, I'll show everyone kind of how to arrange them or you can arrange them however you like, but you get one tutorial per box. But you can definitely use them. And then also, if you have the boxes, you can, I give you the link to our Facebook group. And then you can share and chat with other people who have bought the boxes. And that's only for the people who have bought the boxes. Um, tracing paper and drawing as well. I don't know what the first part of that was. <clears throat> just subscribe my shipping was 17 yeah so it depends where you are I'm not sure but yes you will get charged every month for the shipping um and like this is a first time thing for craft and I 
Um, and they had never done a subscription box before. So it did take a couple months for us to kind of get our footing, make sure everything was good. Um, we were having trouble with the boxes coming smushed. So after a couple months, they, they finally figured out a way to get them safely to most people. There's still some issues. You know, we can't control the post off, like just how people can like handle your packages. We can't control it, but they have done a pretty good job at, fixing that issue and they are pretty good with customer service i know some people have had trouble but if you have missed anything please send them an email again um they are pretty good and if not you can email me and then i can email with them too <clears throat> um and it does take some time so one of the complaints um, that people have said is that they come kind of late in the month. And that is something we're all, we've also tried to rectify in the past couple months. At the beginning, they were getting out towards the end of the month, sometime after. And it's just because we're just trying to figure it out. It is shipped worldwide. So you have to think it's going to different people. So some people are going to get really mad that it's not, you know, at this time of the month, but it's going out all across the world. So they are trying to, they start charging, I believe, right before the first of the month so they can get them shipped out that first week. Depending where you are, depending like your delivery service, sometimes they'll come towards the beginning of the month, sometimes they'll come at the end. That's not really something we can control too well. We do try and send them out as early as we can. It's just shipping and um, it's unfortunate, but we do try and get them. Can we start from number one then onward or has that gone? You don't start from June, you start from September. You're, if you, this is a pre-order, I'm just going to say it again because people will be confused. Um, this is, uh, I don't think, there hasn't been any lost packages. It's just been delayed. And if there is, that's on the delivery company. It's not on Craftimo at all. But most people, if not all, have got them. Um, so yeah, if you are pre-ordering now you are pre-ordering for September your first box is in September and then your full calendar year goes from September 2023 to August 2024 oh you received your June box at the very first of the month this time and then some people are still um uh waiting for this so it, it depends on where you are if I order now how will I get the tin to hold the paints you will get it with your first box if you're, if you are a new subscriber, the tin will come in your first box. Okay. But you may miss out on a, not a miss out, but for January, because this was for January's like free gift, it may, you may not get an extra one. You'll get two with your first box. Are they okay for beginners? Yes. Um, I believe anybody can do this. Like some of them look hard, but like the ones that are look a little bit more tricky with the drawings, you're just, you, you have a tracing template. And if you want to do it on your own, you can, um, but you have a tracing template and I go over step by step. I try and make it as easy as I can so everybody can do it. And based on what I've seen on the Facebook group, so many people are doing like an incredible job. Definitely you can do this for beginners. And it's something you can do again and again over time too. Um, if you subscribe to the annual plan, are you charged monthly for shipping, Karen? Yes, you are. It's just the cost for shipping is what it costs. And that's just, I know some people were upset about that, but just make sure you read when you purchase because it does mention that. I got mine a couple of days ago. If I order, yes. Okay, I think I got everything. Okay. But yeah, so I don't know if you guys have any more questions. But yeah, that's kind of how we created the boxes. And like, <laughs> these are, some of these are my etcher brushes, but like I've had to test out so many brushes. Like these boxes are coming with some fun shapes and sizes. Um, and we're still working on some of the fun free gifts. I'm still working on, I have October's box kind of done um, and November and then December and then I'm done. And then I'm done with all of them and uh, yeah. Can you purchase the past month boxes separately from your subscription? Uh, no, 
you will, what you'd have to do is you'd have to pre-order now and then get them when they, be, when they come out next year. Um, the tutorials will be available forever as long as you have the link. What I suggest you do is once you get the link in, because it's through YouTube, it's but it's private, um, so you can only use it if you have the link. If you have the link, I would save the link somewhere on your desktop, like just so you can always have it. Um, so yeah, if you want to purchase the net the la the past months, you're gonna have to subscribe, and then it you'll just have to wait till like so. If you wanted February's box, you're gonna have to wait till next February in your subscription to get it. <clears throat> If I subscribe for six months, will I have to resubscribe in February? No, it automatically um, resubscribes for you. So unless you cancel, if you don't want it, you have to cancel, but it would automatically do it. So that's what someone, um, they had the trouble, they resubscribed. So they ended up getting two, but they, it will just automatically renew. I get mine late in the month, which is unfortunate on the months that are seasonal holiday themed. Well, I try to make things not like completely seasonal, like I'm or a holiday. So like October, I'm doing pumpkins. But I mean, you can use that in November too, as well. Um, um, oh, sorry, is the annual subscription billed monthly? Or do we pay the full amount on front? You pay the full amount amount up front. Um, but like, I mean, February's was like a floral heart and it came really late, but I mean, I don't know, we're, we're trying to figure it out and things are already kind of set. So I can't really change things for November. I'm planning on doing some like winter florals, which would be good for December. So I plan that in November, but I don't know. I, I'm trying, I'm trying. <laughs> this is all so new to us. So we're just trying to figure it out. How are your cute boys? They're good. They're good. The little one's sleeping and the older one's at school. Five-year-old and a one-year-old. That happens so fast. Um, but yeah, let me know if you guys have any more questions. How long have we been here? About half an hour. Um, but yeah, so the pre-orders are open now. I'm going to make sure that I have... Um, the link in the description. Uh, by the way, your book is amazing. Oh, thank you so much. If you haven't bought my book yet, you could go do that. <laughs> um, can I change my subscription now to a semi annual for the last six months instead of paying monthly? I'm not sure, Kim. I feel like you might be able to, but oh, I don't know. I actually don't know. You might want to message Craftimo. So if you want to message Craftimo, just message them at, I think it's support at craftimo.com. And you can email them there. But I'm not sure if you can change it now. I'm proud of you for your art. Making your art a business. Thank you. It's been a dream come true. And I know some people, once I first released that we were doing these boxes and we had paint and all that stuff, some people were not happy that I was promoting <laughs> something new for people to buy. And they thought it was really expensive. And I get it. You know, art supplies can be very expensive. But when you're given this opportunity, you can't pass it up. You can't say no. <laughs> like, why would I say no to this? This is amazing. It's so much fun. So I'm going to do what I want to do and I'm going to love it. And it's been so, so much fun. So I'm just so grateful that I have so much amazing support from all of you. Um, okay. So I think, I think that's it. I'm going to wrap it up. Um, and yeah, if you guys have any more questions, you can always message Craftimo at, on Instagram as well you can, um, <clears throat> you can, uh, email them. You can message me. I get most of my messages on Instagram. I know that's not ideal for everybody, but that's the best way to reach me. Um, and yeah, I can try and answer any questions. Are you planning a new book or books in the future? Honestly, I would love to. Things are so busy. Maybe when the little one is in school at some point, but right now, like the fact that I had to finish I started writing that book and then I got pregnant and I had to finish that book like nine months pregnant had to get my manuscript in when and then he was born and then I had to do it with the newborn it was nuts and then the box it was just crazy so unfortunately with two kids right now it is just too much I'm currently kind of struggling at the moment just because I have so much to do so I'm gonna wait but I would love to do another book in a couple years 
always do a shameless plug. Go buy the book. Thank you. Thank you, Amy. <laughs> Thank you. I've purchased all of your products and so far everyone knows they're my all fantastic and beautiful. Thank you so much, Kim. I really appreciate that. Can you get the brushes separate? Oh, oh, let me talk about that one second. Ordered the full year. So excited to get a new box. Love the challenge of painting your images using the brushes, colors. Videos are easy to follow. Thank you so much. Um, okay, so also if you look on the website, if it seems like the box is too much of a commitment um, or you're just interested in the brush pairings, what they do have is they're releasing the brush pairing. So what comes like January brushes what was, um, I think this flat wash brush and I think it was a size eight round. So they come together as a pair on their website. Then you can get February's brushes together. You can't get them separately, but you can buy them monthly. Um, and it's cheaper than the box. And same with the paint. You can buy the little four pack that I showed you of the monthly uh, paint. So those are available, but you will not get the tutorials. So just making sure that you know, if you're interested in some of the brushes, you can purchase them in pairs, um, but you will not get them separately and you will not get the tutorials. So that is that. Okay. I think that's it. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I hope that was informative. Um, again, <clears throat> again, if you guys have any questions, please let me know and I will see you guys soon. Friday, we have a flashback Friday video coming out because again, like I'm swamped with so many things um, and I'm just trying to hold on here, but uh, I hope you guys enjoy it. If you guys need a refresher on floral drills and perfecting your flowers, that is what the video is on on Friday. And then next week, I'm gonna have some fun videos coming for you of some new handmade watercolors and some pastel stuff and just awesome stuff. So. Hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day and I will see you guys again soon. Bye everyone.